It's time to sing a tune because Gen Con is coming soon in this episode of Little Big Thumbs. <laughs> It's called the best four days in gaming for a reason. Gen Con is North America's biggest tabletop gaming convention where the newest and hottest games are on display, either to play or to purchase. We at Little Big Thumbs have been keeping a close eye on everything being announced for Gen Con, and while there are an endless number of games to be excited about, we have narrowed down our list today to five games that we think are going to be great for little players and big players. So why don't we just jump right into it and take a look at the first game on our list. Creature Comforts has been a colossal hit for kids' table board gaming, and at Gen Con, I am so excited to see the sequel to that game with my own eyes. The name of the game is Maple Valley, which is set in the same cozy cottage town and involves the younger townsfolk preparing for the spring jamboree. The game is coming from the same creative team that dreamed up Creature Comforts, that being designer Roberta Taylor and artist Shauna J.C. Tenney. Not only am I all hyped up to see and play Maple Valley at Gen Con, I'm excited to share that I'm also going to be teaching the game as part of Kids Table Board Gaming's demo team. Maple Valley is coming to Kickstarter this fall, but I hope to have some memorable experiences to share long before that campaign begins. If Creature Comforts is any indication, the sequel game is one that we're all going to want to keep a very close eye on. Theo Riviere has been the brain, or sometimes the co-brain, behind many of our recent favorite games. We're talking about games like The Loop from Pandasaurus, Detective Charlie from Loki, and Ouch from Devere Games. So it's not a surprise that another Riviere co-design has caught our eye heading into Gen Con. And the name of that game is Oh My Brain. The story of this game places us around a campfire, but it turns out that something is not quite right. The woodland critters around us have all been zombified. We're going to have to fend off the furry zombies with some clever card play and make sure that our brains don't become a critter snack. Oh My Brain was published in French by Lumberjack Studio and is now coming to North America courtesy of 25th Century Games. And this is Big Bean's top Gen Con pick for the entire convention, which means I'll definitely need to track down a copy of this game in Indianapolis and bring it on back to Canada. Oh My Brain is own our list. That was bad. Speaking of Big Bean's top games, one of her all-time favorites is Calico from Flat Out Games. The adorable artwork and puzzly gameplay with a perfectly implemented family mode makes for a game that we come back to over and over and over again. At Gen Con, Flat Out is showing off another game featuring adorable, stunning animal artwork, puzzly gameplay, and game modes that invite younger players to the table. And the name of that game is called Fit to Print. Although this is a real-time game, and that means that Big Bean likely won't be as excited about it, it comes with a slow mode that I think is going to bring all of us together at the table for some wonderful family gaming time. That name again? Fit to Print from Flat Out Games. One game publisher that we absolutely adore is GameRite, and they've produced games that regularly wind up on our table. We're talking about games like Pounce, Ratatat Roll, and Tiki Topple. However, we somehow haven't managed to feature nearly enough of their games on this family-focused YouTube channel. But all that might be about to change with an upcoming release that will be on display at Gen Con. And the name of that game is Teeter Tower. One of our favorite newer features here at Little Big Thumbs is our Dexterific video series, where we take a look at games that have a unique and fun manual dexterity elements. Teeter Tower is a game all about stacking dice and cards and cards and dice. And I think it has the potential to be a smash hit with both younger players and older players. We're so excited to see that with Teeter Tower, two of our favorite things are being smushed together, that being game right games and dexterity games. Teeter Tower, we can't wait to see it in action. Is there anything better than weird 
quirky, goofy dice. How about dice that are in the shape of giant monster truck wheels? That's exactly what we're getting in Bigfoot Roll and Smash from XYZ Game Labs. The game is all about performing epic monster truck stunts with a mechanism that reminds me of my wild experiences playing Robo Rally as a rookie hobby gamer. Not only that, but they've come up with a set of junior trucker rules that will make the game accessible for younger players, which means it's right at the top of our radar as a game that is a serious golden thumb candidate. Between the unique setting, those wacky wheel dice, and an all-around fun factor, this is a game that I just cannot wait to feast my eyes on at Gen Con 2022. And there we have it. Those are the five games that I am very excited to see, play, and in some cases, maybe even bring home from Gen Con. Last episode of Little Big Thumbs, we announced that we'd be giving away a copy of Kabuto Sumo from BoardGameTables.com. And now it's time to find out who has won that prize. So, why don't we go track down the big and little bean, and we'll find out who has won that prize. Welcome back to Little Big Thumbs. And today we're going to be drawing from this hat. See, we got a bunch of names. The person I kind of hope to draw is my cousin Eric. He commented and said he wanted to play the game that we made. Time to draw. Joseph, Let's gonna... big up. One name. I'm going to give it to Chloe Backshaw. Chloe Backshaw said, great video. I was thinking of making a game with my kids when they break for summer next week. This has given me some great ideas. Congratulations, Chloe. We'll be connecting with you on how to get this copy of Kabuto Sumo to you. And thank you all for watching this video. Uh, we'll be back soon. And until then, whether you've got... Little players or big players. Make sure that you're playing games. That make your thumbs go way up. Bye for now. Bye for now. Dun, 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 dun.